ABC News is the news division of the American Broadcasting Company ABC, owned by the Disney Media Networks division of the Walt Disney Company. Its flagship program is the daily evening newscast ABC World News Tonight with David Muir. Other programs include morning news talk show Good Morning America, news magazine series Nightline, Primetime and 2020, and Sunday morning political affairs program This Week with George Stephanopoulos. History Early years ABC began news broadcasts early in its independent existence as a radio network after the Federal Communications Commission ordered NBC to spin off the former NBC Blue Network into an independent company in 1943. The split which NBC conducted voluntarily in the event that its appeal to have the ruling overturned was denied was enforced to expand competition in radio broadcasting in the United States as the industry had only a few companies such as NBC and CBS that dominated the radio market, and in particular, was intended to prevent the limited competition from dominating news and political broadcasting and projecting narrow points of view. Television broadcasting was suspended, however, during World War II. Regular television news broadcasts on ABC began soon after the network signed on its initial owned and operated television station WJZ-TV, now WABC-TV, and production center in New York City in August 1948. ABC news broadcasts have continued as the television network expanded nationwide, a process that took many years beginning with its launch in 1948. However, from the 1950s through the early 1970s, ABC News programs as was the case with the television network in general during that period consistently ranked third in viewership behind news programs on CBS and NBC. Until the 1970s, the ABC television network had fewer affiliate stations, as well as a weaker primetime programming slate to be able to truly support the network's news operations in comparison to the two larger networks, each of which had established their radio news operations during the 1930s. <laughs> Under Rune Arledge Only after Rune Arledge, the president of ABC Sports at the time, was appointed as president of ABC News in 1977, at a time when the network's primetime entertainment programs were achieving stronger ratings and drawing in higher advertising revenue and profits to the ABC Corporation overall, was ABC able to invest the resources to make it a major source of news content. Arledge, known for experimenting with the broadcast model, Created many of ABC News' most popular and enduring programs, including 2020, World News Tonight, This Week, Nightline and Primetime Live, ABC News' longtime slogan, More Americans get their news from ABC News than from any other source. Introduced in the late 1980s, was a claim referring to the number of people who watch, listen to and read ABC News content on television, radio and eventually the Internet, and not necessarily to the telecasts alone. In June 1998, ABC News, which owned an 80% stake in the service, Nine Network and ITN sold their respective interests in worldwide television news to the Associated Press. Additionally, ABC News signed a multi-year content deal with AP for its affiliate video service Associated Press Television News APTV, while providing material from ABC's news video service ABC News 1 to APTV. <laughs> Modern era Around 2015, ABC News began experimenting with podcasts and added an audio channel to its app. On March 28, 2018, the company began its first daily podcast, Start Here. Paula Ferris launched a podcast on November 13, 2018 with three episodes of Journeys of Faith. On September 10, 2018, ABC News launched a second attempt to extend its Good Morning America brand into the afternoon with GMA Day. Topic. Association with ESPN 
ESPN, a sports news organization with several cable and satellite television channels, and also majority owned by ABC parent company The Walt Disney Company, provides sports bulletins and video footage for some of ABC News programs, especially the network's overnight news programs. America This Morning features a segment of sports highlights provided by the overnight anchors of ESPN's flagship sports news program SportsCenter. Topic. Programming Topic. Current ABC News programs 2020 June 6, 1978 Present ABC World News Tonight July 10, 1978 Present America This Morning July 5, 1982 Present Good Morning America November 3, 1975 Present GMA Day, September 10, 2018, present. Nightline, March 24, 1980, present. This week, November 15, 1981, present. The View, August 11, 1997, present. What Would You Do? Formerly Primetime, What Would You Do? February 26, 2008, present. World News Now, January 6, 1992, present. Topic. Digital programs. Ten percent happier, 2015 present. Real Biz with Rebecca Jarvis, 2014 present. Topic. Podcasts. Ten percent happier with Dan Harris, March 11, 2016 present. 2020, November 4, 2017 present. Everybody's Got Something, September 19, 2016, present. Journeys of Faith, November 13, 2018, present. Ten episodes with three premiere episodes. A Killing on the Cape, October 25, 2017, present. Motivated, June 26, 2017, present. A Murder on Orchard Street, October 3, 2017, present. Nightline, November 30, 2017, present. No Limits with Rebecca Jarvis, January 9, 2017, present. Perspective, November 9, 2017, present. Popcorn with Peter Travers, August 26, 2016, present. Powerhouse Politics, February 19, 2016, present. This Week with George Stephanopoulos, November 12, 2017, present. Uncomfortable, March 21, 2017, present. World News This Week, November 3, 2017, present. World News Tonight with David Muir, December 1, 2017, present. Start Here, March 28, 2018, present. A 20-minute audio cast hosted by Brad Milkey. Topic: Former ABC News programs. Topic: Newscast programs. AM America, January 6 to October 31, 1975. Business World, 1987 to 1990. Good Afternoon America, July 9 to September 7, 2012. World News This Morning, 1982 to 2006. Topic: News Magazines. 2020 Downtown, October 1999 to 2001. Close Up, Day One, March 7, 1993, 1995. Our World, September 25, 1986 to May 28, 1987. Primetime, August 3, 1989 to May 18, 2012. Primetime Thursday, 2000 to 2002. Turning Point, March 9, 1994 to June 17, 1999. Topic: Public Affairs. College News Conference, 1952, November 1960. Issues and Answers, November 1960 to November 1981. Topic: Other Services. Topic. ABC News Radio 
ABC News Radio is the radio service of ABC News, a division of the ABC Television Network in the United States. Formerly known as ABC Radio News, ABC News Radio feeds through Skyview Networks with newscasts on the hour to its affiliates. ABC News Radio is the largest commercial radio news organization in the U.S. ABCnews.com ABCnews.com launched on May 15, 1997 by ABC News Internet Ventures, a joint venture between Starwave Corporation and ABC formed in April 1997. Starwave had owned and operated ESPNet SportsZone later known as ESPN. Com since 1995, which licensed the ESPN brand and video clips from ABC's corporate sister ESPN Inc. Disney wanted more control of their Internet properties, which meant ABCnews.com was operated as a joint venture with ABC News having editorial control. Disney had also bought a minority stake in Starwave before the launch of ABCnews.com and would later buy the company outright. The website initially had a dedicated staff of about 30. In addition to articles, it featured short video clips and audio from the start, delivered using Real Audio and Real Video technology. Some content was also available via America Online. In 2011, ABC News and Yahoo News announced a strategic partnership to share ABC's online reporting on Yahoo's website. The deal expanded in 2015 to include the Disney ABC Television Group. Topic 538 538, sometimes referred to as 538, is a website that focuses on opinion poll analysis, politics, economics, and sports blogging. The website, which takes its name from the number of electors in the United States Electoral College, was founded on March 7, 2008, as a polling aggregation website with a blog created by analyst Nate Silver. In August 2010, the blog became a licensed feature of the New York Times Online. It was renamed 538, Nate Silver's Political Calculus. In July 2013, ESPN announced that it would become the owner of the 538 brand and site, and Silver was appointed as editor-in-chief. The ESPN-owned 538 began publication on March 17, 2014. In April 2018, ABC News acquired the site from ESPN. In the ESPN, ABC News era, the 538 blog has covered a broad spectrum of subjects including politics, sports, science, economics, and popular culture. Topic. ABC News Live In 2018, ABC News introduced a streaming media service called ABC News Live, available through Roku and the news division's other streaming methods. Content from the broadcasts is used as well as original content produced for the service. Topic. Former Topic. Satellite News Channel Satellite News Channel was a joint venture between ABC News and Group W that started on June 21, 1982 as a satellite-delivered cable television network. SNC used footage from ABC News and seven Washington, D.C.-based crews, in addition to stories from other overseas networks to provide a rotating newscast every 20 minutes. However, this channel had difficulty getting clearance from cable systems, so ABC News and Group W decided to sell it to its competitor, CNN, a subsidiary of Time Warner's Turner Broadcasting System. CNN ceased satellite news channels operations on October 27, 1983. SNC was either replaced by CNN or CNN2 on most cable systems. Group W eventually shut down seven years later, in 1999. Following satellite news channels' discontinuation, ABC News did not return to the 24-hour cable news world until 22 years later, in 2004, when they launched ABC News Now, whose launch indicated that satellite news channel was ABC News' first attempt in the 24-hour cable news world. Topic. ABC News Now ABC News Now was a 24-hour cable news network that was launched on July 26, 2004 as a digital subchannel by ABC News, being the company's second attempt in the 24-hour cable news world after Satellite News Channel. 
It was offered via digital television, broadband and streaming video at abcnews.com and on mobile phones. It delivered breaking news, headline news each half hour, and wide range of entertainment and lifestyle programming. The channel was available in the United States and Europe. Its talk back feature allowed viewers to voice their own input through the submission of videos and personal thoughts on controversial issues and current topics. It was shut down as a digital subchannel when Live Well Network was launched. ABC News now was replaced on cable providers with Fusion on October 28, 2013. Topic Fusion Fusion is a digital cable and satellite network that is owned and operated by Fusion Media Group, LLC, which was a joint venture between ABC News and Univision Communications. ABC and Univision formally announced its launch on May 2, 2012. Launched on October 28, 2013, Fusion features a mix of traditional news and investigative programs along with satirical content aimed at English-speaking Hispanic and Latino American adults between the ages of 18 and 34. Fusion was ABC News' third attempt in the 24-hour cable news world after Satellite News Channel in 1982 and ABC News Now which it replaced in 2004. In December 2015, it was reported that Disney was in talks to sell its stake in Fusion to Univision. The split was complete on April 21, 2016. Topic personnel topic Correspondence and reporters topic Former plus symbol indicates person deceased topic International broadcasts Several ABC News programs are broadcast daily on OSN News in MENA. In Australia, Sky News Australia airs daily broadcasts of World News Tonight at 10:30 a.m. and Nightline at 1:30 a.m. as well as weekly airings of 2020 on Wednesdays at 1:30 p.m. with an extended version at 2 p.m. on Sundays and occasionally primetime at 1:30 p.m. on Thursdays with extended edition at 2 p.m. on Saturdays. Coincidentally, that country's public broadcaster, the Australian Broadcasting Corporation, operates its own unrelated news division that is also named ABC News. The US ABC News maintains a content sharing agreement with the Nine Network, which also broadcasts GMA domestically in the early morning before its own breakfast program. In New Zealand, ABC World News was broadcast daily at 5:10 p.m. and at again at 11:35 p.m. As with the BBC in the UK, TVNZ7 owned by Television New Zealand aired the programme commercial free, until the channel ceased operations on June 30, 2012. See also ABS CBN News and Current Affairs References Topic. External links Official website